Penny, uh, would you tell us a little bit about this program for single mothers and how you all got to this point? I would love to, love this program. So Single Mothers Program, it is a program fostered out of the love and the ambition to make sure that we don't leave anybody behind. How do we, as women that are in our careers, have had successful lives, how do we make sure that we are helping those that may not be as fortunate as we are, that have had obstacles in their life or in growing up that prevented them from having the opportunities that we've had, or they have had the opportunities, and through the course of their life experiences, it led them down different paths. And so as a single mother, a long time ago myself, I remember what it was like barely making you know, ends meet. How do you survive with all of the, the, the gas prices and the daycare prices and the food costs and the rent and all of that when you're a single mom that may not be getting very much support from other people? And so we decided to look at how do we you know, give a hand up to those that are wanting to improve their lives? So we created a program called our Single Mothers Program. And it is a program that is looking at all of the different obstacles that a single mom could face in trying to better her life. So a lot of it is education or certification or getting some type of a skill set. It's looking at daycare, transportation, um, food, um, all of these different, you know, how to help them feel empowered, how to help them have a corporate etiquette so they know how to, to talk and be, and be present in, in certain conversations with people in corporate America. And so our program is all about our partnership with Emory, where we are offering single mothers that are living in poverty the opportunity to get cybersecurity certified by Emory. So, so imagine that first. First, you have a woman that doesn't have any education or has some, and now she's going to have a certification from Emory on her resume. And so it's a 12-week course where every single Saturday from 8.30 to 5.30, uh, these women go um, online because it's virtual and they learn about cybersecurity. We've partnered with Uber to provide free transportation services. We've partnered with um, another nonprofit called um, Sheltering Arms that provides free childcare service for the women's children where the children are learning technology at the same time the mothers are. So imagine this, we have the single mom living at her home Uber comes up, drives up, picks up their child and the mother, takes them to shelter in arms. The mom drops off the child and then Uber takes them back home so that the mom is at home virtually learning cybersecurity and she has no obstacles to distract her from being successful in listening to the professors that are teaching. We have phenomenal partners that have donated money that allow us to provide them um, food. And so we got them a little Uber Eats card and all they do is order food and it's delivered and the food for their child is being taken care of by sheltering arms. And so they're able to have all of these obstacles removed to help them to be as successful as they can. If they don't have internet, we've partnered with AT&T to provide them internet at an incredibly low, low cost to them. And we are able to offer all of this at no cost to them because of donations, because of our sponsors, and because of foundations that have seen the value in what we've done. And I will say, we just had graduation about four weeks ago. We had enough funds to offer the program to 20 single mothers. We had 19 that graduated. They had an average GPA of 96%, 96%. And right now, through the graciousness of Patty and her dedication to serving and giving back, she is working to place every single one of these moms in jobs. So right now, we've got five of them that have been offered jobs where they went from making less than 34,000, they will be making over 50,000 with benefits, sign-on bonuses to make sure that they don't lose you know, their home or their apartment while they're trying to get money to start their job. And they will go from making over 50,000 a year with benefits. But that is the core of what it is. It is to give them a hand up, not a handout, and help them to uh, make themselves more successful 